Black Box Production. Black Box Production. Black Box Production. Black Box Production. Production. The possibility of squashing beef with Gucci Man. And I found that headline extremely interesting because just with my intelligence as a human being, it was obvious that through um, the headline, and I've seen multiple headlines, that this is something that wasn't like something that they were both against. And whether either of them would be against it totally, I find it real ironic that two cats who have had a homie smoked in public type beef. When I say public, meaning from the moment it happened and the case and the situation according to hip hop have turned into like legendary situations uh, with T.I. Tippy Tip Tipster, Cliffy Harris. He, uh, we all know about his situation, how his homie got his cap peeled, rest, his homie feel rest in peace. And um, then with Jeezy, a lot of us know, that really know, a lot of people might not know, you know, more contemporary fans might not know that it was a time when um, Gucci Man fought a case for a body for one of Jeezy homies in the midst of they beef. So now here it is, two individuals who done had a homie smoke up in a public scenario is discussing squashing uh, a beef with one of them with the cat that they had the situation with. Now look at the difference here. In Jeezy's situation, at least as far as I'm understanding, I think Cuz kept it gripping. Cuz ain't cooperated, participated with the prosecution in any way to try to get Gucci Man, you know, dealt with by the peoples. As far as I understand, I've never seen or heard anything to make me believe or think or suspect that Jeezy, you know, did anything but keep it a Google according to the G code. You know, it's, you know, it's a real highly publicized scenario situation where his homie lost his life, and I don't know nothing about Cuz getting down or. Uh, Telling or ratting or participating in snitching, but I'm confused as if with you know with Cuz being a homie, this individual Jeezy who done without me asking explain to me personally why he crip. Like right, Cuz explain to me how and why. I don't know if it was just because by encountering me and being around me, Cud thought he owed me that type of explanation, but Jeezy then gave me involuntarily his reason of why he ever jumped off the porch with this cripping and what he told me was it was like if you want to be on the block getting money where he was at that's what they were saying it had to be and cub was like shit i was so on my bread that like he was like that was easy call you know apparently and i'm adding this part you know the g the g nature that's already in you you out here trying to eat really about your bread, not really tripping on no game banging, but it's so heavy and serious where you at, the cast that's out there, you know, in that life is saying the only way you finna be out here doing that, you know, we know you got rights to being around here based on whatever else, just the way you grew up and raised, but this what it is right here, he like, that was the presser applied. And Cud was like, that's what made Cuz turn crip. So, you know, I always just knew that about Cud. Like, me and Cuz ain't never had no problems or nothing. I'm just saying, like, Cud, why is Cuz on there chopping chopping up game with a cat? You know, Jeezy, I know you seen Cuz on the stand on behalf of the prosecution in that murder trial, Cud. Oh, God, on oh, my mom, my mom, this, this cat steady hollering for a paperwork party in this digital world where we going paperless, and he refused to upload that digital paperwork he got. He got the paperless version of what he keep talking about, the paperwork party. Don't cancel the party. Don't be a party pooper, Tippy. Oh, my, 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 I just thought that ironic. A cat that, in front of the whole public, lost a homie in some deep beef with it would apparent would it be a apparent L. Kept it G, from what I can understand, because I ain't participating until unless I miss something. 
and uh, this other cat get out and it's, get caught up in the same scenario and do the exact opposite, but you on here discussing it with him like he part of the tribe of the, of the ones, of the real G-Code. That's like, I don't get that, cuz, on Crip. On my mama, mama, I was young, cuz. 1996, cuz, New Year's Eve. Finna turn into 97, a year the whole set been waiting on for years, cuz we from the cell, we from 97. My G homie, Big Milk, cuz, I went to the swap meet with cuz, cuz. And cut, and he didn't make it to C97, cause 1996, after 5 in the p.m., swap me clothes at 7. We was trying to catch the swap me before clothes, and then make it to Kinko's to get some pictures, obituaries and stuff, put on a t-shirt. Got to the swap me, so it was around 6, 7 at night. Cut lost his life December 31st, 1996. I was with Cut, squabbles and all that, with the gunmen and all that, on my mama mama. My loved one, had, he had two daughters, cause I had to go back tell his wife, love you, big draws. Demon, what up, Crip? Love me not self, death though. But uh, on the set, I had to go face the whole hood. I'm from East Coast, nigga. Well, my mama had to face the whole hood. I had to take my word, cause on what it was, cause the homie died on my watch. On Crip, cause so the detectives pressed me and the homie Lil Milk Cub pressed his hard body cause we was young. When the homie died, that was my G homie Cub was only 27 cause I thought Cub was grown grown. They pressed us hard cause to get on the prosecution team and testify anything we can say about them cats. We refused. We stuck to the G code like tippy tip tip lie about doing. On Crip, cause we stuck to the G code. We didn't tell, cause it's in the nineties, cause immediately them same detectives gave my homie Lil Milk the murder, cause of our homie. We three, we went to the swap meet three deep, all loving each other, all pushing the same shit, all finna celebrate a year we've been waiting for forever. On my mama, mama, it went bad. I'm with Big Milk and Lil Milk. Big Milk passed. And because we wouldn't tell on the cats that killed Big Milk, sticking to the G code, that's why I don't get no cat no pass when they speaking on experience about this. I done lived this. Oh, my mama, mama, what you was doing New Year's Eve 96, Tippy? This is what I was doing. Lost the homie, refused to participate on behalf of the prosecution. So when Big Milk passed, the same detective that told us and showed us they knew who did it, they needed us to point them out that we refused to turned around and then charged Lil Milk with Big Milk murder. And instead of ending up on the stand on behalf of the prosecution, a real crip ended up on the stand on behalf of the defense to make sure they get that 32 to life up off my low on crip. These, these cats got it b knack words on my mama mama. That's why we don't f with fake friends. What it do, Eastwood? On my mama, mama, tap us, check us out on the Loki EP. Fake friends available on all digital platforms. Shout out to the Sell Love. Hey, well, if it's on and it's on, I'm laid back, stacking, blowing the brief feet. Cotton Louis protected with a freak in the seat. Benji Frankie stay in my vision, even more when I'm sleep. I count the bands when I count these sheep. I'm in the streets, switching lanes on the forges while posying out the paper plate. The licks with my niggas was playing, call it the great escape. Friends nowadays, they ain't loyal like how they used to be. And you ain't really real like you saying, nigga, you used to be. If he your folks, then he my folks, if that's just how we roll. If he ain't, then he ain't mine, now let's get super blown. I be, I be, I be, I be dipping, I be rolling, I be smoking, I be smoking, I be sipping with the turn up to the ceiling. Off the turn up, yeah, I feel it. Fake friends, I don't do it. Tell them niggas they can kill it. Yeah, so if ever my niggas need me, I be there in the flash to get the bags out the stash for that all black Whoa. rag. Don't let that ain't your nigga, then he ain't my nigga. And if you my nigga, you should know we don't do that lame shit never. I'm a friend, my nigga, and that's something that my niggas all should know. Well, if that ain't your nigga, then he ain't my nigga And if you my nigga, you should know We don't do that lame shit
shit never I'm a friend, my nigga And it's something that my niggas all should know Hopping out on feet, aiming at the enemy, squeezing Little Hennessy or Remy, all I need for a reason Quarterback for years, I did plenty receiving Now I'm coaching while approaching my 20th season Every turn I get, I leave the mic in a tourniquet Tonight might light the roof on fire, let it burn a bit Don't dance, never did the Dougie or the Nay Nay No romance, neighborhoods love me, I'm a Nay Nay I'm way more proactive than a lot of these cats Not only that, me and Woodrow know how to react Death before the sign on shites, never See me run some BB guns in the streets with PP sons. Eastside dumb. In case you're wondering where I'm from, 197971. SPI fly crippin' to the day that he die. RIP to JR and Baby B.I. Well, if that ain't your nigga, then he ain't my nigga. And if you my nigga, you should know. We don't do that lame shit never. I'm a friend, my nigga. And that's something that my niggas all should know. Well, if that ain't your nigga, then he ain't my nigga And if you my nigga, you should know We don't do that lame shit, never I'm a friend, my nigga And that's something that my niggas all should know It's the beast My night the thick and the thin, the up and the down, it don't matter. It's where we at now. The only cat that I could consider industry, that ain't no telling. I might bump into it at at an EC function. Out the blue, doing what he do. He don't need me or you. He just true. Made me eat my words on some banging doses lyrics you heard. Well, if that ain't your nigga, then he ain't my, my nigga. nigga. And, and if you, you my nigga, 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 you should know. We don't, we don't do that lame shit uh, never. I'm, I'm a, a friend, my nigga. And that's the that East Side my niggas, Riders you know. do f well, with East Wood. Well, if that ain't your nigga, then he ain't my nigga. They probably nigga, didn't used to. You, my nigga, you should know. He politics like I'm politics in the real East Side Bay. That's the that my niggas all should know. Some of his homies just say brave. But he was smart, swayed. The homie never chose up. Been black ragging since he rose up. Oh, my mama, mama, shout out to Woodrow. It's about that time, y'all. We're going to keep it a Google and do what we do. I love y'all for, for with me like I f with you. I'm going to see you here next time I'm supposed to see you here, just like y'all going to see you here. Do me a favor, though. Be about your marathon at all costs in the meantime. My mom always says that I have an old soul. Whatever that means, she says that while other kids worry about toys, I worry about helping those in need. I guess that's true, but I still love toys too. I think what makes me different from other kids is that I'm ready and they are not. The end. Sniper and that puzzle. Big shout out to my nigga SPI, Spotter Low. You know, I'm in the black box. Had to come through, tap in, show love one time. Yeah, y'all make sure y'all subscribe. Stay tuned. All that. Yeah, yeah, Sniper and that puzzle. Give a shout out right now to SPI the streets. My nigga Spotter Low, y'all already know what it is. So I'm snapping. Oh, yeah. And don't forget, check my website out too. Nipsyhustle.com. Tupac of my generation, Pac was, was highly intelligent, but in our culture, street culture, especially in his generation, intelligence was viewed as a form of weakness. How do you get the people that's really affected by, you know, what we're trying to solve involved? Yeah. Family broken, so I stand with my niggas. Showed up to every shootout, but I ran for my feelings. No time for those, I got a plan to get millions. Whoever don't agree, I see you back at the buildings. That's why I never let y'all act like a victim. That's why I never let y'all kill my ambition. You weren't built for the mission. Park my colors in the back of the village. Remember Tony started washing them dishes. It was all a decision. Fast died, he took a part of me with him. Heart broken like my artery missing. Just fuck all of you niggas. Team broke, they can't harvest you nigga. Swore shit, it got a heart to it nigga. Are you so know you won't go fold them? Are you so know they have to count on you? All that pressure they bestowed them. Pray my son never face what I go through. Yeah. Get it, don't wear that 
From the Nile down, stakes is huge Snakes and fakes, straddling the gate It's too late to choose The violent visions gave victory Paid your dues Motivated, demonstrated, elevated views Truths don't die, we multiply I ain't make the rules Self-medicate, meditate, and celebrate the blues Neighborhood, roller coaster, You can take the cruise, I'm good Blue laces, suede Puma's favorite shoes Jesus to the generation Ain't you never say me on my babies Most beautiful gift Puto ever gave me such a precious life, who decides price? I couldn't feel the slide twice, cause they crucified Christ. I used to know that I could count on you. All that pressure they bestowed on me. Pray my son never face what I go through. Can't understand it, can't call family, no, 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 no Got crossed by my closest, I ain't gon' show too much emotion, no, no, no. My low one call my phone, I pick up right away I know I'm living wrong if it's the right way I was too busy trying to get heavy, I was lightweight A lot of niggas here can't be with me, ain't on my side today I been trying to live with some of these songs in case I die today Every time I need something to lean on, I drank that spot away So it don't feel how it feels to me Cause I been through it and it did what it did to me I trusted you and that was big for me That's my little partner, you do that big for me And I ain't never jumped in my feelings, I hear you for me Big shout out to my nigga SPI, Spotter Low. You know, I'm in the black box. Had to come through, tap in, show love one time. Yeah, y'all make sure y'all subscribe. Stay tuned. All right.